I always ask for um, for you to be open, transparent, and honest with us. Um, I know that we provide you with benefits, and that's great. I also know that we have obstacles and challenges that sometimes are between you and us, and, and that's okay too. I, I recognize them, I know them. For the most part, I know what those are, and I'm working to minimize those. I know it's hard to understand the set point between your organization and ours. It's the same way that I feel about our national office. Sometimes they're great helps, and sometimes it's like, oh gosh darn it, you're in our footprint, or you're, you're doing something I wish you wouldn't be doing. It's just the, the process of working in a network. My goal, is, and the other thing I will say is I know that there's other, other systems that are out there and, and all of that. My biggest wish is that we all come together in this network. I don't want to be feeding America. I want to be feeding America down here with you on top because you are the most important piece of this whole system and network. Um, and I want to be that support to you. And it's going to be times that it's wonderful and you're excited, like coolers and lift gates. Um, and other times it's going to be, you're out of meat again, I wish you had meat, or fresh produce is wonderful, but I wish there was more. Those are okay. Um, that's part of working together in a, in a collaboration. There's good times and there's times that we have to challenge each other. Um, but know that I am working for you. Feeding America is working for you. I recognize our history and our past. I know all the goods and the bads about the organization. My goal is to keep helping you, but I can't do that if you don't keep communicating with us, too. It's um, about things like, is there anyone here from Green Bay? OK, a um, quick example of Green Bay. They, um, Green Bay has a great community of pantries. And there was a frustration, and I couldn't figure out what it was until we sat down one day and we worked through it. And it turns out that they wanted us to help support purchase from a Save-A-Lot grocery store because they didn't want that grocery store to go away because it serves a food desert. Once I knew that, now Feeding America gets access, uh, gets product and purchases some product from that Save-A-Lot. I wouldn't have known that was an issue if we didn't have communication. So please feel free to challenge, question, push, anything you need to do. And in United Healthcare, um, I'm representing your voice. So when I go to United Healthcare and say, they loved what you did and they want more. <laughs> I'm carrying your voice that way. And it's not because Feeding America gets something out of it. We do, but it's because I'm representing you.